Welcome to ASU TV tonight. I'm Easton John. The show that is not filmed in front of a live audience, but filmed by lively people. My host, my co-host to my right, Ty Phillips. Ty, how do we feel about that? That was a good surprise. Was that okay? Okay, so he... Is that he okay? Yeah, no, 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 it was good. So yeah, Easton okay. told me, he's like, hey, I got a surprise. And I love surprises. No one surprises me much, so I love surprises. And he said, I got one. And that was a good surprise. So, so should I keep that? Should I be like... The show that's not filmed in front of a live audience, but is filmed by lively people. What I think, think we could, and we can always workshop later. We can workshop it? Okay, yeah. awesome. Okay, well, Ty, so this week was pretty interesting, and that segues us into our new segment that's called... You going to go to it? Yes, there we go. Talk of the week. Here we go. So, Ty... You worked for ESPN this week. I did. I did work for ESPN. I worked utility. Mm -hmm. And so how did how'd you get that, and what was what was so fun about that? So how I got that is, uh, so Mr. Sullivan, uh, he does a thing to where, like, media students, the ones that work in the sports production, he offers them roles and positions uh, through email uh, to go work on ESPN crews whenever they're coming to, like, broadcast. I've worked football i've gotten to travel a little bit so it's like a great opportunity that our cmp faculty provides for their students so i got the email i, got, I was like oh that's perfect and they they pay you too mm -hmm. so this isn't free you're getting paid good money you're getting good experience it's great and you also get kind of a workout like i feel jacked oh, you jacked? oh dude i was lifting cables i was like boom boom look at this boom. Thunder. you got thunder and lightning right there man all right now. smith and hey, weston now. boom boom hey man so, and also, while you're working, you saw some pretty cool people there. I did. The guys from Barstool actually came to the to the game last night. To the game. They were in the arena and mm -hmm. to meet the players, and they gave, like, a pregame speech. Yeah. And the guy whose name was Frank the Tank. Mm -hmm. Super cool dude. Big Frank and so I, I didn't want to interrupt because, you know, I, I was working for ESPN. I wanted mm -hmm. to be professional. I did not want to, like, intervene at all because – that's not professional, and they're there to do a job. I'm doing my job, mm -hmm. but I'm still going to, like, look and be like, oh, that's so cool. And so he gave a speech to the players, and while I was setting up a booth, I was listening in, and he was like, listen, guys, Troy, you know, many, many years ago, was taken down by a Trojan horse, and guess what? Today, I am the horse. Said, and I was, was getting riled up. I got was, goosebumps, like, just dude. Goosebumps, just describing himself as a horse. He was the horse. And there, I came across a funny picture, actually, on, during uh, the game. It was posted on Twitter. And it's funny because, you know, you have, you have Rico Bosco on the left. You have Frank the Tank in the middle. You have Coach Butch Jones on my right. And you know who's right behind Coach Jones? Red Wolf Roundtable's very own Tristan Harlan got blocked from the picture. You could see his right leg piercing out. No, yeah. his right leg is piercing out of that picture. It's no. the it, it, of all the people of all the coaches, it would be Butch Jones just to be, be like right in front of him. But gotta, his his kneecap made the picture. I gotta sit by Frank the entire game mm -hmm. because that's where my I, that's where I was underneath the basket. Mm -hmm. So the entire game, I gotta listen to kind of him. And, like, the Barstool guys, like, and I got to listen to them, like, kind of talking, yelling yeah. at the refs, and which is so cool. And, like, you would think, like, you know, at a game you'd be, like, disrespectful. They were pretty respectful. Like, yeah, they called out the guy for – because, like, there were calls that you you missed, man. Yeah. That's on me. A couple travels here and there. Oh, dude, it, they were walking. Like, they don't, they they probably got two miles. Right, just I know. They got, they got travel miles last yeah, night, man. Yeah, Frank the Tank, he reviewed the hot dog at J-Towns. I haven't seen the video yet. I uh, do know the ranking. What was it? Can we get – oh, we could get a sneak peek. I, I don't want to see. You don't want to see – No, wanna because you're going to have to tune in because I'm not taking that. You're not taking that from Frank. But also he was doing his walk, and you had a pretty interesting story about one of your friends wearing uh, – a, t a specific team that Frank the Tank does not it, like. Uh, yeah, I did hear like a story about that. You did? Yeah. So you did? Do you not want me to go into it? I, I don't think I want to go into it much. Oh, so, okay. So we'll cut that out? If we could. Okay, that'd be great. Okay, so also during the game. Did you, okay, during the game, Frank the Tank, and I know we're talking all about him, but that was like, a good majority mm -hmm. of like the celebrities there. Yeah, he they gave him the T-shirt cannon. Oh yeah, it was sniping. Dude was pumping the cannon up and just, 
It almost hit us <laughs> in the box. <laughs> yeah. I know. Yeah. He, they were really just kind of class acts, I mm -hmm. feel like. Like, you know, people, Barstool might have, like, a reputation of just being kind of that frat guy, you know, just not caring, just all sports. But throughout, they were getting our student section up. They were, like, cheering for the Red Wolves. They came in. They did a what good job. What were they yelling at, at the refs? Do you know? Yeah, they were just yelling, call the call the ball. Uh, Frank the Tank said, yo, ref, how much you got on Troy one in this game? That's funny. And I, I, I chuckled. You chuckled. I, I was like, oh, my gosh. The student section was lively. They, dude, uh, I'm just working here, man. Yeah. And, so, but, if you guys didn't see behind me during the intro, there's a big piece of paper. Oh, dude, now so for, cool. I, this is this is hilarious, but I took an archery class this year. Kind it's of it's it over. It's done. I, yeah, you see it right back there. I'm going to show you, the guy, you guys the target and the damage. But we have a picture of when I drew it. Yeah, this is me in my apartment. You why know, why do you look like that? Hold on. Why do you look like that? Kindergarten style. Kindergarten? That's what I was thinking, bro. Kindergarten style picture, you know, uh, that you, Look at that target, you know? I'm kind of looking at the apartment itself. You have the Coca-Cola. Yeah. So, dude, and you have the toaster oven in the back, dude? Of course. And so, yeah, we I drew that target, and, you know, our uh, I don't know what to call him. Coach Spencer, Mr. Spencer. Just let call us, him your instructor. Just let just, Our instructor let us shoot the target, and this is the damage. Come on, zoom dude, on. you missed. I missed quite a bit. There is You're, what did you learn from that class? Nothing. I honestly just went in there and sh and just shot my arrows. You know? If the Hunger Games ever happened, I am. Hey, not man! If hold on, like I think I did pretty good. There's just some missing. Let me see it. Like, if you want me to stand up. No, because I I would be your target, right? Mm -hmm. Get the mic up to you. So. Okay. So. Yeah, that'd be. Those are all hits. Those are all hits. This is not a hit. That's a graze. That's no, just. Th this is. This is me talking back to you. This is a hit, for sure. You got. There's not any like deadly shots though that are. No, I would. I would say this one's pretty deadly right here. This one. This one. That one's straight in the. I mean. Dude, you're taking me down. I'm taking you down, but, you know, it's pretty impressive, you know. I, I thought, you know, I drew You would take me down? Look at how, you know how many circles I had to draw to make this look good? How long did it take you? It took me a good 30 minutes to do this. 30 minutes? Yes, just to, like, draw perfect circles. My, you know you know what's funny? Roommate Mitchell actually drew the, the big circles because I couldn't draw a perfect circle. I had to use, like, a bowl and a pot for, like, all these and then a little red Solo cup. And then a little coffee creamer thing. In my no, that looks like a shot glass one. That one's little. Yeah, it's a little bitty one. And so, yeah, I I, I got one in the red. That's the only thing that matters. Why like didn't a, you take, like, I don't know if this is just me being me, just like a ruler? Yeah. And then just putting it into it and going, have you seen those? Like, yeah, I, I have. I, I just didn't. I don't have a ruler. Go to the library. You I can don't, get them. I don't have a ruler that I need. Library they, has them. They really? Dude, there's so many resources that the School of Arkansas State University, and I'm not even trying to hype them up. Mm -hmm. There's so many resources they have. The EQ checkout, the library, the really? faculty. Just, dude, you have to, like, dive into it and explore the university. Okay. There's so much they just give. So if you had to rank my target at a – one through ten, ten being good, one being bad. Three out of ten arrows. Three, three out of ten arrows, not not hitting with the the shots, but like the design, the overall design. Yeah, th three out of ten. Originality, not. So you, so I'm getting like an F on this project. I wouldn't give you an F. I'd give you a C. A C, you know, for just, just because C. like it's not even circles. You need circles, Ethan. You got. I don't know what you want to call those. They're squiggly lines. I know, I'm sorry, Ty. I just I, I couldn't do better. Ty, we, I expected. We need to have a drawing competition then. Dude, <laughs> cue me up. I can make a mean pig. You mean a mean pig? Yeah, I mean, just like <laughs> one circle, one circle, one big circle, one, one circle, circle, one circle, circle, one big circle, one circle, one circle, one big circle. W W W W E. Is that how you draw a pig? Yeah. Have so you ever seen a TikTok? I've never seen that TikTok. But you know what? 
your brother actually, ATO Corby John, knows how to draw Homer Simpson pretty dang well. Your brother? Yes. He knows how to pull draw. Pull him up. Pull him up. Dude, when is he going to come I visit? I don't know. Maybe. I, probably during graduation. So he's, ah. he's got a torn ACL or a torn whatever. In no, he knee. doesn't. So, yes, he does. He, no, he doesn't. I swear he does. Walk it off. What's his name? Corby. Corby. Ty Phillips. Ada Gamma. Walk it off. <laughs> Walk it off now, mate. All right. Well, that was talk of the week. When we come back, we have a special guest joining us with some taste testing a little bit and trying to guess them. So you're watching ASU TV tonight. You're not going to want to miss it. I think one of the things I learned at Arkansas State was life is 10% of what happens to you, 90% of how you respond to it, and that's just something that I live by. A-State is home, and they're going to treat you like you're a part of the family. Like Look that. at us you go! Like that. that was all right. That's just a little something I, I just put together. A little bit of spice. A little espresso. So. What did you just say? Espresso. I said spice. What does espresso have to do with it? A little bit of, you know, a little bit of, you know, mixture with your coffee. I don't know. I'm just, coffee, dude. Come on now. You know I don't like coffee. You've yeah, seen oh, me yeah. taste it. Yeah, yeah, that was disgusting. But I thought it was milk. That, I was like, what? We have a special guest coming to our show. He's the one, he's the main reason why we are all here. It's ASU TV's very own. He's walking to the stage. Tristan's taking over. Did you get over. spit cups? Huh? We have mugs. Are you joking me? I'm Do you serious. have one? Huh? What? Can you grab that trash can on your way? He's ASU TV's very own. He's, he's everybody's favorite helper. Bring in the trash can. Mr. Sullivan, everybody. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. This is your mug. That's not mine. <laughs> what are you going to spin into? No, this is Mr. Sullivan. Oh, no. We're all partaking. Are you sure? Dude, yeah, because I'm excited. Okay, well, Mr. Sullivan's going to guess them. Okay, close your eyes. He's going to guess these seeds. I'm going to hand them to you. I'm going to tell you to put your hand in. He's going to guess these seeds. So, wait, Let's before say, we begin, before we begin, <laughs> is his mic on? Yeah, his mic's on. So, Mr. Sullivan, introduce yourself. What do you do? <laughs> yeah. Hello, I'm Dustin Sullivan, instructor of creative media production and sports media faculty advisor for ASU TV. Uh, Mr. Do Everything, right? Yeah, he's Mr. <laughs> he is Mr. Do Everything. He so is. what brought you here today? I don't know. Something about y'all. <laughs> something, yeah, something. Y'all, y'all, uh, so, okay, do we need a backstory while we're doing this? I yeah, think sure. we do. Cause yeah, yeah, sure, yeah, sure. Let's All right, so I made a, a, I guess, a crazy TikTok purchase a few weeks ago and bought the sample pack of smacking seeds. Yes. Mm -hmm. Which included, what was it? The OG, cracked pepper. Churro. Cinnamon churro, garlic parm, dill pickle. Oh, man. So then the yeah. comment is made to me, or I'm asked if I've ever had Biggs seeds. And I said, no, because only seeds I've had before that are David's. David's seeds. He's David. What's the difference? Do we? Yes, uh, there's a size difference. There is a size difference. David's jumbo seeds are a larger seed in itself um I feel like david's been around and, and to me this signifies the beginning of baseball season mm -hmm. i mean spring training games started yesterday there's a bunch of them on right now and there's no better way than sitting and watching a baseball game at home or at on location than sucking down and spitting out some seeds exactly so we want you to close your eyes all right eyes are closed okay well, i got these on Oh, no, I'm scared. I'm going to tear him. You're going to probably need to bring that. Uh, we should have got a cup or something. No, you got a mug. You got a mug. Uh, okay. I'll, clean, I'll, I'll clean the mug. Clean the mug. We're I'm you're in, usually the one cleaning the dishes. You're in, you're in charge of cleaning the dishes. Oh, will you clean my dishes yeah. too, sweetie? This hand. Okay. Oh, Mike. <laughs> How much did you give him? Give him a couple. You know, I, I want to make it enjoyable. Okay. Hide that. Okay, you can open your eyes. Give us a live taste review. Hey, yo, pause. What's that about? 
I don't was know. That, I don't know. I don't know what the, that was. We got Tristan back there. Yeah, we, Tristan, Tristan. we put Tristan on graphics. God help her. <laughs> oh, oh, no. So, what's your, what's, what, what, what do you think? think? I'm going to get to the seed. Dude, I would know immediately. There would be no question. It's going to be like the original, like salt, right? Okay. Okay. Can you get, can you go down to the brand? That was so satisfying. Yeah, to hear that was kind of satisfying. I can, I'm having years, I'm not like, Alex Rodriguez, I've seen examples like guys in Major League Baseball just take the seeds and like throwing them out. Yeah, exactly. Like and just nom, like a, I like did a that game. on television too. That's fantastic. Yeah. One, well, we can you know put something up. Yeah. So what's the what, what brand? Well, do you look think at that is? sound. I mean, it's got to be David's, right? Yeah. That's no. There's no way. Yep. That David's right. original. I I was uh, Ty told me to get Bigs, but I wanted to see if you could guess David's. Yep. So there's something about. The like the very beginning layer of salt. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like it's like a spread of salt instead of like a sprinkle. Mm -hmm. Is that what? Okay. It's it's pretty much like salt baked. Okay. Now now I'm a big seed guy. Close your eyes again, Sullivan. We're going for the next. Do you need to cleanse your palate? No, I'm good. You need water. Oh, that's made me waste seeds. How dare you? Don't give them a lot. Just give uh, them. I'll give them. I'll give them two. Uh, well, no, 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 no. It's you need take three. More than two. It's about five. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll give them I used to have. I'd be the seed soldier on my baseball By team. By the way, I'll, I'll disclaimer: please, students, turn in all your assignments on time. If Wait. you can't, please contact your professor if you're having any issues. We'll do a sound. Oh, I got assignments to do tonight. Well, Thanks, what sound Sullivan. Do you think it is. Mmm, beats me. That's like heavy. Oh yeah. Ow. Mm. <laughs> oh, that old bay? No. Huh? No. No. Wait, what is that? No, no, no. He said old bay. What's old bay? It's like a season. You, you've never had <laughs> old bay. <laughs> so, is that the crab one? Is that the crab one? Yeah, you put it on. It's like a seafood. Okay, seafood yeah. Seafood, everything. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's okay. So it's not old bay. Hmm. Because he doesn't. Oh, this is wild. I'm having a great time. <laughs> Ty has too much fun during these, like... It tastes really good. He has too much yeah. fun okay, with these. Okay, think. Is that Taco right. Bell? Yeah, that's Taco Is that Bell. Your yes! Taco Bell. Final answer! Taco Supreme. The best flavor of seeds. It Dude. took a minute for, like, the flavor... To kick of in. The sour cream and the oh. meat. You can taste the sour cream. Yes, I, mm-hmm. you can taste it all. I cannot taste Dude, the sour cream. I... When I w- I had to film a baseball game for Peyton the other day, and dude, I was killing some seeds. There's the sour cream, like after you get the first layer of salt mm-hmm. off, and then you can really taste all the flavor. Go, go, Ethan. But you gotta let it absorb. You can't just automatically chew it. Get you some. Okay, I can't taste. Yes, sour cream. sir. Because you don't know until you're told. Yeah. The flavor is not in the seed itself; it's in the outside. Yeah, and I was trying to teach my friend Tan about like how to eat a sunflower seed. Mm-hmm. Because I, I guess he's never really eaten them before. Yeah. And yeah. so it took us a bit because at one point he would just try to break them with his hands. Mm. Like, no, 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 Tan. Got to do it. Got to do it. It's all one. It's all in the mouth. It's all in the mouth. Okay. So we got the next one. All right. How's your shot? This one I'm excited for. This Personal one. fave. You know, I don't even like sour cream that much at all. I, I do. That's, that's a good balance there. This one changed your life. All right. I do that. Get it. Get it warmed up. Ow! I did it again. <laughs> really, man? Killing me. It's right here. All right, here we go. Now I don't know if the Davids and the Taco Bell will throw them off. You no, know, I'll taste a difference, sir. <laughs> what? what? You can't hear the noise of me like shrucking on him. He's, he's, he's just we can thinking. Add, what are you thinking keep... right now? What are you? What's the? What's the taste you're thinking? A pickle? A, Did you just say, say a, a pickle? pickle? Is it? No, no, that's not a pickle. Don't tell him. Wait, what do you? What are you tasting right now? Hold on. He has to go in for seconds, dude. Come on, Sully. That was a bad seed. That was a bad oh, seed. No, yeah, yeah, you got. You, there's always that one seed that's, you, you know, that's like. Ugh. Oh, have you got like the stem one time? Mm-hmm. I, I those I would like try to see how far. I, can I want some more. 
Whoa. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Who wants a second try? Is it just to taste, or do you like them that much? I like it, but I need a, I need a shock of the Show taste Show the camera again. the bag. Not okay. the hand out. <laughs> He's like... I didn't hurt myself that time. There you go. All right, you're good. Why well, I got like a Southwest flavor to it? it is it, it really? It, it, it is very I'm salty. I'm going to have to try this whenever. Oh, wait, wait. I know the flavor. I just can't think of the name. You can't think of the name? No. What do you think? Do you want me to tell you? Yeah. You're going to hate me. Bacon! It's bacon. You know what's crazy? This smells like, I'm, I'm being dead serious, Ty. This smells like bacon bits. Dude. Like dog food. That's what bits. I was getting. I just couldn't. There's some other seasoning it mixed with it. If it was it just straight. Like bacon bits. Like no, I've had it. Dude, you forget. I was a seed soldier back in my baseball career. I, did. <laughs> I had two bags of, se- of bacon and two bags of taco in my bag at all times. I like how just Ty just like said, give, just like reached out for the bag. Didn't even ask. Just just give me the seeds. All right, we have one more. This one's kind of special. Let's wait a minute. Okay. <laughs> He's got it. good. So which one do you like the most? How could you get dill pickle from them? Oh, yeah. How'd you get dill pickle? Let's talk about that. Oh, no. Dill pickle is honestly, you, I know you don't like dill pickle, Ty, but it is honestly. Okay. Don't spill the ah! <laughs> Stand. There we go. So, are you ready for the next one? I'm getting there. Let's okay. go. Okay. All right. You're going to want to show this. You are crazy for that. Now, I don't know if I trust you. No, I wouldn't. Oh, man, man, hold on. Should, is there... You're wrong for it. Is, should we be concerned about, like, people being allergic? I'm not allergic. What are you allergic to? Nothing. That I know of. I used to be allergic to some antibiotics as a kid, <laughs> but not anymore. <laughs> These feel, like, heavy. Mm-hmm, they're okay. in... Put them in. Put them in. They're special. <laughs> Oh, those are not regular sunflower seeds. Those are um, pistachios. Yeah, they are. They're pistachios. I'm so... Mm-hmm. What I love are you pistachios. doing, Ty? I love pistachios. What are you doing? They're pistachios. I love pistachios. I, I, I didn't think he was going to get them you that quick. You ever had a Dude. chocolate-covered pistachio? Oh, I've never had one. Oh. But I love pistachios. Here's my thing. He didn't even take it. He got that faster than he got the bacon. Yeah, that's crazy. You People said, eat bacon you said, in the morning. A, this ain't a seed. I love the layout you got. We look like oh, yeah. we're sponsored by Big. Oh, yes. <laughs> Big and David. Are we not sponsored, by the way? Like the the karma drinks that I would bring. Up. <laughs> I don't have any more, so we're gonna have to. You're gonna have to send me some. Karma's Eastern boyfriend. Mm-hmm. But yeah. So what out of your favorite? Which one's your favorite? David's the OGs. You really. Like the original? That's crazy. But you, I am more than open to bigs and other flavors. I'm surprised you didn't get like a barbecue one, honestly. They have barbecue. Barbecue. You got to go to Wall of World. getting like Crack a Takis. Pepper. There was Takis now? They had Takis. Oh. You, mm. Dude, but can I you imagine a Dorito-flavored <laughs> one? Hmm? A Dorito-flavored that one? That would be good. Is there one? No, I just came up with it off the dome. All right, well, email bigs. Let's get, <laughs> let's get a or Dorito. Smackin'. Or, or schmacking? Schmacking. Well, because you could just, like, make so it nacho why cheese. is it such a big TikTok trend? This well, they go around to, especially, like, during spring training. Mm-hmm. They're in Florida, or they're in Arizona, where, you know, the two big, you know, spring training sites are the, for the uh, Cactus League and the uh, Grapefruit League. Mm-hmm. So they're there actually giving away small bags to baseball players. They'll say, hey, do you like seeds? Hey, we've got these. And it, it, to me, that's really great brand building is immediately just go to major league baseball parks you know for spring training where the guys are really more relaxed than they are during the regular season Mm -hmm. say hey you want to try our seeds can you give us a rating just the fact that they get a rating from a major league baseball player in several of them i think is great marketing for them that's awesome. I think I, I would have thought I'd teach a lesson uh, about sunflower seeds. Literally, he it. can make a lecture out of anything. 
Honestly, don't get it's, me. It, it's the most. You remember the Taylor? You remember the Taylor Swift Chiefs game? I remember we had to cover it the next day. He sends us an email. He's like, hey, guys, made a new script. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, we covered it. You mm -hmm. did? We so, had to. It was in the new script. Well, Mr. Sullivan, we thank you for coming on. Thank you. And I, I, I hate to say this, but you got to run the board back. There, I'm going to so. go make sure you go to commercial. Yeah, so make sure, yeah, stall, stall for Yeah, so make sure we go to commercial. What's your favorite? What's my favorite? See, Look run, at that Mr. Run. Sullivan. Dude, he, dude, he's fast. I'm telling you. He, he has got some speed on him. But... I think my favorite, Taco Supreme, 100%. Really? Dude, I would kill this bag. I, if, I like tacos. If Ta I if I was on TV right now, I'd kill these bags right now. Dude, I was so tempted. That's why I spit mine out, because I really wanted to start killing. I'm an OG bacon supporter. Mm -hmm. I used to have bacon in my bag at all times. Mm -hmm. Sizzling bacon was always in my baseball bag. Um, I probably spent most of, like, my money... Mm -hmm. in high school on bacon seeds. That's awesome. Well, we're going to head to commercial break. When we come back, we have two more guests coming on the show to discuss a little bit of what happened last night at the basketball game. You're watching ASU TV tonight. We'll be right back after this. I think one of the things I learned at Arkansas State was life is 10% of what happens to you, 90% of how you respond to it, and that's just something that I live by. A-State is home, and they're going to treat you like you're a part of the family. Welcome back to ASU TV tonight. My name is Easton John. Ty Phillips to my right. We have two special guests. One that was a part that is part of a ASU TV staff and one one of the most talented movie makers we've ever had on on ASU TV. And the other one, biggest ma hype man biggest I've seen. Biggest hype man I've ever seen in my life. It's Red Wolf Roundtable's very own Tristan Harlan and Jacob Osborne. He did a special intro, dude. Look at that. I mean. What's going on, boys? How are we? This is a lot of people. Yeah. yeah. yeah is, so, Sorry I'm not more professionally dressed. I've kind of been busy today. That's okay. But, you know, you two were a part, and I mean, all, all four of us basically were a part of the A-State game and the A-State pregame show. Unfortunately, you know, due to internet things, it did not turn out so, it didn't turn out well. But yeah, Don't get me started on it. I know. It's it's. it's it's kind of frustrating, but what were some of the, Tristan, I'll start with you. What were some of the things that you wanted to, like, talk about and stuff like that? So we, we did, we, well, we did the Puritan interview, like, we did it. It just wasn't on the thing. But some of the things I wanted to highlight was how important the game was to not only us as an ASU TV brand, but just kind of mending the bridge that is us and athletics, trying to do more with them, whether it's here on your show, whether it's Jacob and some of his films, getting athletes involved, or just on Red Bull Frown Table as a whole. That's kind of what I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. And it so far, it seems like it the bridge is kind of intact. Mm -hmm. But, you know, when, when you're – Doing a pregame show and everybody tells you yes, 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 it's gonna work and it doesn't work. Yeah. It's just kind of frustrating. Yeah. So Jacob, what'd you what'd you think? Yeah, of this I was so behind far? the scenes the whole time and I didn't even know like there was any problem until after they were already done with everything. Mm -hmm. And then I heard everybody talking about it. I was like, oh, that's that's not good. Because the interviews were really good and mm -hmm. you know, those were my first time really working with Red Wolf Round Table and 
Yeah. I liked what I saw, and I, it stinks that it didn't work out. Now, Jacob, did you stay for the game? Or I did not. You didn't? So you, wow. you, so I should have. Uh, so I'm sorry. Is, I'm no, sorry. I'm sorry. Stay. I'm you're sorry. Good, you're good. Loser. What's up, guys? Listen, man. The game was legendary. It was pretty good. Mr. Sullivan feels bad. Aw, it's That's, okay, Mr. Sullivan. No, it's it's yeah. fine. It ain't your fault. It ain't it ain't your fault. Fumble. It ain't my Fumble. phone this time. It's Ty's. It's Ty's. But, hey, so, Jacob, lady. this is going to be new to you. And right. I want your sort of reaction. But, Tristan, man, you got pretty rowdy that game. <laughs> I got pretty rowdy. rowdy is an understatement. He sat right behind me. Mm -hmm. Mr. Sullivan, could we roll some of those videos like that, that we have show. prepared? I mean, th this hey, is, well, first off, Storm the Court, which was coordinated by Rico Bosco. And you can see him. He's can, wearing the hat. Oh, yeah, Tristan, there, there's your hat. You lost your hat during the, uh, <laughs> yeah. during the Storm the Court. Look, look at the speed on Tristan in the, in the right, bro. Did you see <laughs> Can we replay like, that? Oh, my God. And then Tristan just making a miss. Doink. That was honestly... It worked. That's Can we replay Tristan. Tristan's run? Can we? Re Dude, honestly, that basketball court has given us so many memories. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Look at him. Dude. <laughs> He's like, ah. <laughs> so, so funny thing about that, for those of you that are watching at home, that was prior to me losing my hat and prior to me breaking my glasses, getting them stepped on and having a crack in my lens. And, yeah. And so, all that was filmed with Ty's phone. So, Jacob, what do you shout think? Shout out, Ty's phone. Shout, shout out, Ty's disaster, man. And then I mean, what? What do you think of this? <laughs> I this will. Is okay, okay, okay. So, okay, so hold on, hold on. Hear me out. Hear me out. So there's a girl that's too. Let's see. I'm looking this way. So she's beside me, not with Connor, the guy behind me, but she's to the other side of me. And Connor looks at her and says, "You know, you got to distract him. You got to distract him." And then he looks at me and he goes, "Flashing." Mm -hmm. And I said, I'm not flashing him because I had my Red Bull Round Table shirt on mm -hmm. and I had my media pass still on. Mm -hmm. And you still got to act professional with the media pass on, but sometimes. Yeah, um, sometimes. But so he goes, Flash him, flash him. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm not lifting my shirt and flashing him because I got a lot of hair and I'm very, I got a hairy chest, so it's going to look stupid. <laughs> look, that would have distracted me. I'm going to look like a orangutan or something. Mm -hmm. So I said, All right, I got you. So I always wear a white shirt underneath, just, you know, it's something I've always done, something my dad did, something I've done you know mm -hmm. screw up doing it so i had it on and i said all right i'll do the next best thing i'll lift my shirt up but with the white shirt i'll shake my stomach to, you know because when you see a fat guy doing a truffle shuffle then you think it's kind of funny <laughs> so i did it and sh he looked so i it's it's weird but i've done this so many times so i know what to look for the guy looks at the split second he shoots Wow, thanks, Sully. <laughs> um, you can, if you look closely, you can see his eyes go from the rim down to me right as he's releasing the ball, and really? I start shaking, yeah. and that's why he missed. That's awesome. there's your science behind this thing, dude. That's awesome and so strategic. Awesome. You might have to be an honorary mascot, honestly. Uh, yeah, exactly. Listen, I, I have good friends that are mascots. I'm not going to say their name to protect yep, their exactly. gimmick and their kayfabe, but just know when the when the mascot gets rocking. If you know, you know. It's kind of one of those things that we've always been a part of. Awesome. And so I kind of want to go into this next thing. And, you know, speaking of sports, we have a new segment. And I think you guys are going to enjoy this. This is just a little fun game. I know everything is talking about serious basketball, you know, Tristan, you know, dancing in front of the goal and stuff. But we're going to get into some sports charades. Let's get it. So it's gonna be. Did you make this? Yeah. It looks cool. That is cool. Yeah. So it's gonna be Jacob and I versus Ty and Tristan. You don't want that duo. You don't want the smoke. Are you sure? Okay, it's so, legendary. So I'm gonna have Jacob. Jacob, can you be the guesser since you have the, the portable microphone? <laughs> yeah, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> so here, take the hat. And we're honestly, and we're pulling from the. I wanted Cooper to be here so that he could pull from this hat. But just, I kind of want you to just throw the hat away. No, don't throw away. Don't, don't throw away the hat. Just you're gonna want to stand up. You got like you. We got 30 seconds. 30. You seconds. want to explain the rules to him? Yeah, yeah 30, se 30 seconds. You gotta act out. You gotta take one and you're gonna act them out, one by one. And can't many, speak. Yep. Okay. And just and keep track in your head how many we get. Okay. I'll do my best. Okay. So, Todd, you wanna you wanna man the timer? I seconds. feel like we're at a disadvantage because Easton probably wrote all these down. No, I didn't write all these down. 
I can't. I, I'm Daniel not the biggest sports guy, so it cancels that out. Yeah. So. Ready? Yeah. Exactly. yeah. Set. Go. go. Oh, I don't even know what this is. Um, can I skip? I'm skipping yeah. that one. Rowing. Yep. Um, uh oh. Right. Fifteen oh, no. seconds. Oh my god. Hang on. Hockey. Yep. Twenty-five seconds. <laughs> what is that? Ballerina? Just stop. D no. Oh my god! Dang it! What was it? That was supposed to be gymnastics. Oh, we got two. Two. We got two. All right, All right. I'm about to cook. Do you want to guess, or do you want me to act out? I'd rather you act out because I'm a little, a little hefty, hefty, and I don't want to look. You like only that. have to beat two. Yeah, it shouldn't be. It's two not that. Hold this for me. Yep. Okay, I'm ready. All right, go. Soccer. Why oh. couldn't I get that? Fencing. Boxing. Badminton. Pickleball. Uh, 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 -oh. uh pass. Uh, I don't know. No way. Pa no pass, way. pass, hurry, hurry, hurry. Five seconds. Hurry. Come on, Tom. Three. Baseball. Baseball. Golf, golf, golf. Yep, got it in just the nick of time. Ooh. In the nick of time. Tie so Tiebreaker. Tie so I'll do it. Field hockey. Oh, I'm and sorry. Ping pong. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Sorry. So I'll, me down. I'll go out and I'll go hey, out and we act. Didn't lose. I'll go out and act. We almost did. We should have had that down. I don't know. We should have. We should have blown him out of the water. I'm sorry. But dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. Hold on. Okay. Let me get my oh, timer. Oh, what'd you say? What? Did you just say a bad word? Dummy. Yeah. yeah. Okay, here we go. Hold on, bro. Yep. Hold on. Hold Three, you. two, one. Oh, you got me. Oh, no talking. Um, um, horse oh. riding. Uh, I know what it is. I don't know what it's called. I don't no know talking. what it's called. Uh, no, that's not. That doesn't really. Uh, no, he, no, he can. He can. Like he can. Swimming. Five seconds. Uh, I don't know what that is. Two, <laughs> one. Ah, you I got, got one. one. Sorry, Tristan. <laughs> to end we it. got this. We got to it. end it all. Am I going? Get you one. have to get two. Okay. Yeah. Focus up. We got two. All right, come forward a little bit. We want to make sure you're in that camera shot. Okay, three, two, one, go. Football. Baseball. No way. Uh-oh. Dodgeball. Yeah! Oh, dang it. Hurry, one more. Hurry, hurry, Dodgeball hurry. Dodgeball is a sport, by the way. Football. That's two. Ooh. That's a winner. Keep Dude. going. We're, we're going to kill yeah. these. Keep going. Best ball. <laughs> Rugby. Time. <laughs> That's so funny. That's so good. Good job, guys. I don't know what yeah. you went. You know what? Honestly, oh, that hurt my knees. You, you guys went a bag of pistachios. Heck yeah, I like pistachios. You guys went a bag of I'm pistachios. I'm allergic. What? <laughs> You're I've never actually never had a pistachio. You never had a, oh, we'll, we'll, <laughs> I'm trying one we right now. We'll go to break out, or we'll end the show right here after this. What do you think? Yeah. It's pretty good. You like it? You yeah. like pistachios? Yeah. Well, you guys win those pistachios. You can have them. That was ASU TV tonight. Thank you guys Ooh. for watching. And yeah, we'll see I'm you guys next week. Oh, gosh, Tristan, come on. <laughs>